prospective candidates in Singapore's next elections can get their paperwork done more easily. And voters can expect a sleek experience on polling day. Vote counting will also be faster yet reliable. The reason? The Elections Department is rolling out new hardware and online services. Vanessa Lim gives us a sneak preview. If you look at this ballot paper, it's not clear which party this voter is voting for. In fact, some voters have done this in the past, making their vote invalid. So to try to minimize this and to standardize, voters will now find this pen inside the booth. Now it works like a stamp, just a light tap, and it leaves a small cross. It also doesn't smudge, and it's supposed to be waterproof. The pen is one of the new gadgets for the upcoming polls, along with this portable booth for voters in wheelchairs. And these recyclable cardboard booths will be trialed in some constituencies. They cost about $30, a fraction of the current ones, which cost about $750. The booths are used just once, so storage costs are reduced. On polling day, voters will be registered electronically. This is much faster than the previous practice of manually checking their NRIC numbers against the electoral roll. And when the time comes to count the ballot papers, these machines will speed up the process. The Elections Department is planning at least 40 roadshows to introduce voters to the new procedures. Prospective candidates will have an easier time too, as they'll be able to do most of their paperwork online, from appointing an election agent to applying for a political donation certificate and paying the election deposit. The country is now awaiting the report from the Electoral Boundaries Review Committee, which was formed almost four months ago. The election must be held by April 2021.